Choosing the right note-taking app can make a huge difference in how you organize ideas, manage tasks, and boost productivity. In 2025, privacy, flexibility, and powerful features are more important than ever. Today, I'm comparing any type and app flowing, two standout options that take different approaches to note-taking. So let's see which one fits your need best. First, ease of use. Any type is a visual-driven app with a clean interface and block-based organization. It's intuitive and great for those who like a structured but flexible system. AppFlowy, on the other hand, is an open source alternative to Notion, designed for those who prefer a simple minimalistic experience. According to users on G2, any type feels polished, but has a slight learning curve due to its unique approach, while AppFlowy is easier to pick up but lacks some advanced features out of the box. Now let's talk about features and customization. AnyType is all about privacy and local first storage. It offers a block based approach similar to Notion but with end to end encryption and offline capabilities. Captera users praise its beautiful UI and flexibility in organizing content. AppFlowy is also privacy focused but takes a more modular approach, allowing users to build their own workflows. Users on Trustpilot appreciate its open source nature and ability to self-host, though some mention that it currently lacks the depth of features found in other tools. Next, let's talk about pricing and scalability. Any type is free during the beta phase, but its final pricing model is still being developed. Some users on G2 are concerned about how pricing will evolve. AppFlowy, being fully open source, is free to use and can be self-hosted, which makes it highly scalable and cost-effective for those comfortable managing their own setup. Finally, let's talk integration with other tools. Any type currently lacks deep integrations, but has an API in development. It's designed as an all-in-one ecosystem, which some users appreciate for privacy reasons. AppFlowy, on the other hand, is more flexible due to its open source nature, allowing users to build their own integrations. Trustpilot users highlight AppFlowy's potential for customization, though they note that it requires technical knowledge to fully leverage. So which one should you use? If you want a polished, block-based privacy-focused app that works offline, any type is a solid choice. But if you prefer an open source, modular, and self-hostable alternative with more customization potential, AppFlowy might be the way to go. So in the end, which one do you prefer? Let me know in the comments below. And if this video helped, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more tech comparison. See you all in the next video.